Back. I wonder, hang on. I'm gonna switch styles and... Okay, it doesn't change the uh, the menu style, so... Ah, yes, saving. Autosave is a good thing, but shouldn't be relied upon. Kavinsky Nightcall? No, that was uh, Sword of Truth by Magic Sword. Uh, let's ring the bell. Oh, I should have known it'd be you again. The Swordmaster says you can jump in the lake, by the way. What do you want? I think I'd just like to browse. He has nothing interesting. Okay. Wake me up if you need anything. Oh, okay. I see what you're talking about. Oh, a circus! I love a circus. Even when they shoot me out of a cannon. Actually, hang on. Is there anything in there? No. I keep going in there thinking something's going to happen. Did you know the governor's been kidnapped? Uh, well, yes, we knew about that. I'm going after those immaterial authority figure nappers. Are you with me? Uh, well, the governor could probably take care of herself. And we are sort of busy here. Yeah. And we've got the circus to think of. We've got to find the elephant. <laughs> and get rid of these minutes. I'm sorry. We simply can't go at this time. I'll just be running along now. Let's see if there's anything in the voodoo shop. I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Oh, she! Whoa! Hello. So you have returned. To I wasn't expecting that. Yes, I must go after the governor. I see you with some others willing to help in your cause. I really hate that flashing. It makes me see spots. Quiet. I am getting another vision. You must. Must what? You must go to Monkey Island. No shit! You will search for the ghost pirate, LeChuck. He hides deep, deep beneath Monkey Island. There is only one thing powerful enough to destroy LeChuck. What? It's an ancient root. Once prepared, the root can destroy a ghost with one touch. Yeah! I'm getting more. More vision. Spill it! I see the cannibals that live on the island. Ooh! They are helping you, or eating you. I can't tell. The vision isn't coming in clear anymore. Great. Now go. And find the one that loves you. But be warned. Don't worry, I'll watch out for LeChuck. Not of LeChuck, of yourself. What you will find out about yourself and your world. It will terrify you. I just remembered something very important. Cricket, did you pay more than $20 for this video game?
No good. <laughs> I, I think at this point we've all seen that uh, seen that one. So. No thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. So cannibals living on the island. So that means that we're going to run into an army of leather faces. Or, uh, or... Excuse me, but the... Well, it's only you again. I guess there's two killers from Dead by Daylight that work for it. There's only one in existence. Now get lost. Ah! Okay, fucking hell. Move my window. So I stop clicking my other monitor when I'm trying to move to the left. Actually, can I just... I can't just, like, WASD this, can I? No. Had that box, Loom, Indian Last Crusade, Zack McCracken, Manic Mansion, or Maniac Mansion. Stan's previously owned vessels, and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. What sort of craft are you looking for? Big, fast, slow. You want it? I got it. I am I taken it, aback I'll by this man's it. incredible sense I of style. You a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're gonna leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. We, we've got the old animations, but I, I like his voice too much. Now this, this is a ship fit for a king. I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. We're talking two pools, one indoor, one outdoor. We're talking rotating ballroom. We're talking heated crow's nest. We're talking 200 feet of ocean-going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, let's talk about money. Your money. I have 371 pieces of eight. I think we must be talking about completely different ships here. You've obviously been out of the ship market for quite some time. I doubt you're carrying enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? All I have is this rubber chicken. Is it one of those rubber chickens with a pulley in the middle? I already got one of those. Oh. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Well, heck, I can understand that. Nothing wrong with being indecisive, even if it is a waste of my time. So, what else can I show you? I don't really have that much to spend. 
Have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain. But if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. I just want this guy to talk forever. This here is the famous Sea Monkey, the only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say, anything? You see, the previous owners of this ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. TM. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. What kind of price range were you thinking of? I have 371 pieces of eight. Look. This is a very reasonably priced ship, but not that reasonable. I don't think you've got the cash for this transaction either. You do have some other means of payment, don't you? On uh, second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I tell you, I got a feeling you're gonna leave here today with a new previously owned vessel. So, what else can I show you? Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. I forgot to give you my <laughs> What the fuck? And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass. With your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here. So if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. I love him. I love him so much, everyone. I adore that man. If it wasn't for his voice, I'd be thinking Bruce Campbell after that. There's no answer. No answer. He, he did everything that he was involved in the plot for and he fucked off in Anarnia. I know I'm probably going to have to go back to the, uh, to the hook house eventually, but I'm, going, I'm exploring a little bit first. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. The Fettuccini brothers. So, uh, for people who are just joining us, uh, who, who have joined us ever since we did the uh, did the puzzle, uh, there is a game called Dungeons of Dreadmore, which has an item called the Helm of Threepwood. It is, in fact, a pot that you stick on your head, referencing that particular puzzle at the circus. And it's a very common item, so you usually pick one up no matter what run you're on. Dungeons of Dreadmore has a million references in it. Like basically everything's a, re a reference. Got the t-shirt. 
What do you want now? I want us to make up and be friends. I want you to go away and leave me alone. The governor's been kidnapped. What? That's ridiculous. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this. First volunteer! Me I'll meet you at the dock. We still can't go into her house, but that's okay. We got our first volunteer. <laughs> I love your enthusiasm. It's much more fun. Just, just go in. Go in hard. What would you rather listen to? Uh, someone who's really excited to do everything, or someone who's just kind of droll and boring like this? Drone. Max crew size for a galleon and his four and Sea of Thieves. Two more to go. time to show you any more tattoo tricks the governor's been kidnapped what that's preposterous oh really so glad we've got that note. note they left oh no this is horrible what are we going to do we could get a crew together and sail off after them what an idea! Now, if we only had a captain. What about me? Ha! You! Ha! 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 That's a good one. Hey, I'm serious. Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. Walk this way. Talk and this way. And I want to show you something horrible. Something, something so devastating. That I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. After all. It's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago! Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Ha 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 ha! Silly me! you open this last door yourself. Just let me get out of your way. Wait. <laughs> Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that all? Okay, go ahead. If you've got the guts. Cam Clark, not familiar with any other uh, roles of his. <laughs> it's a parrot. I don't believe. 
believe it. You are a brave man after all. You faced the beast I've feared all these years. You had the guts to do what I never could. I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 decks. Oh, come on, Meat Hook. You're a big, strong, good looking guy with a talking tattoo. You can swab my decks anytime. <laughs> Phrasing! Really? Sure. I could still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Hey, maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea. Wow, this is sounding better and better all the time. Captain, what are you doing back here so soon? You didn't think I was chickening out, did you? Uh, no, of course not. I just wanted to tell you that, uh, I got a crew. Everything's A-OK. -okay. <laughs> hey, that's great. So I guess I'll see you at the dock, right? Right. See you there. See you there. But, uh... <laughs> Still, phrasing. Holy shit. Swab my decks any time. We never got any souvenirs. The sign is a lie. Okay, so... I guess we go talk to the shopkeeper? Um, Stan did mention that if we had a job, we could get a line of credit, so... Let's go investigate that, I guess. Cam Clark did some unnamed character voices in Mass Effect, mostly guards for Citadel and Exogeni. Oh, that's nice. my eye on you, boy. Steal anything and I break your legs. What do you want? I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You are? I, uh, you Indeed. Got a job? Yes, of course I do. All right. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. That was easy. Two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, okay. Um, Let's see here. What did you say your occupation was? I'm an acrobat with a traveling circus. You're one of them fettuccine brothers? Where's your silly accent? And where are your silly slippers? Come back when you got a job in a credible business. Okay, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to have him do it again. Oh, he's gonna do it again. Okay, okay. Well, 
One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Okay. So, uh, where's... Notepad, notepad, notepad. Three, counter, two... Okay, I think I have it. Uh, Cam Clark Meat Hook also did the voice of Canada in the original English dub of Akira. Damn! I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. But again! Be right back. And don't touch anything! Okay. So, pull, pull, pull. Push, push. Pull, pull, pull. Push. in here but this note I the good and honorable storekeeper do hereby take liability for the debts of the bearer of this note for any amount up to 5,000 pieces of eight nice and we're just we're just gonna leave Robin the shopkeeper, you're a pirate now, dog. Yes, I am. Let's talk to the lookout. Any sign of the governor? None. As I said, I fear we've seen the last of her. Look, I told you. I haven't seen a thing. Now, if you're worried about her, go out and get her. <sighs> also, Yakko Warner, yep. To the used ship emporium! again I knew you'd come back everybody does you know why they come back just look at all these ships I've got something for everyone come take a look around so what else could I show you uh, could I see the cheap one again I knew it. I knew it. Just can't get her out of your mind, can you? Walk this way. Hard to stay away from a good mystery, isn't it? Hmm? Just how much were you looking to spend today? I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, chronic gambling mishaps. I mean, who am I to judge, right? If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income, right? Uh, 
Right. Absolutely Let's get right. Down to brass tack, shall we? I know you want it. You know you want it. And I know that you know that I want to sell it. So Let's talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. For instance, did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? Oh! I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. But wait, Did there's more. The anti-lock anchor. Anti-lock anchor. Hmm. I'm not sure how much you can lock an anchor. I don't know though. Sounds like it might be useful. I'm waiting for someone in chat to say, don't tell him a fucking thing! Jeez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. <laughs> That's why it's already included in the price. Ah! Wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Jeez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. I want to see how I much you can go about through. The lure sail covers. Geez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? Does he just have like a million of these? I think he just has a million of these. He's like about extras already. Okay, where were we? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 10,000 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. Sure, I guess we can start out at the bottom. I got all day. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week, so you got me over a barrel. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. I'd like to make you an offer. Great, how much? I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. I think we're working in the wrong direction here. I know you can try harder than that. Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away? Today. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? How does 3,000 pieces of eight sound? That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. You realize, don't you, that they just don't make them like this anymore? How much should I pay for my car? I'd Quite like a bit. Great. How much? Okay, okay. 4,000 pieces of eight. That's a little bit more like it. But not much. I know you can try harder than that. Buddy, you can tell me the truth. It's the little woman, isn't it? You're afraid of what she'll say when you come home with a new ship. Don't be such a wimp. Stand up to her. She'll respect you for it. And when she sees this ship, she'll love you for it. Trust me. I love this guy so much. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? All right. 5,000, but that's my final offer. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. 
I know you can try harder than that. I don't understand. I thought you were interested in this ship. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just ten thousand. Ah, he's not lowering his price. Gotta do some extras, here? yes. Let's talk extras. Did I tell you about the tachometer? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? I'm not married. There's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? I can definitely live with that without live that, without that particular piece of junk. junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? You can't see my face right now, but I'm very confused. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. It's not wood to Did begin I tell with. You about the porthole defoggers. Oh, oh, we're cycling. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? I'm just going to tell him no on everything now. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. God, but he is wait, just every, more. like, asshole salesman in one. Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 7,300 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Okay, okay. 4,000 pieces of eight. I think we're working in the wrong direction here. I know you can try harder than that. I'd let you take it out for a little spin around the harbor, but our insurance company won't let us. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 7,700. What? You raised the price! You bastard! Out? Let's talk extras. Did I tell you about the taco meter? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? It takes a while, but he will settle. Particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate. Do I just need to like wood. spam the five thousand offer until there's he takes more. it? Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 7,750 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. 
How much? All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. I'm on your side, buddy. It's my boss that's the real miser. But it's your used ship. You know what? Never mind. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? 5,000. And that's my final, final offer. That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Not if you're in a deflationary economy. That this is the only ship lot on the island. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? 5,000. And that's my final, final offer. That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? I'm just thinking of my kids' education fund here. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away today for just 7,300 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? 5,000. And that's my final, final offer. That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Actually, I'd like you to squirm a little more. Sure. Hey, that's my job, isn't it? Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away today mm. for just 7,300 pieces of eight. This man's getting on my nerves. I started out loving him, and now I'm like, you know what? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. I think we're working in the wrong direction here. I know you can try harder than that. Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd still like to pay 2,000. That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know? Uh. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell... The oh, Jesus, he's jacked up the price. For just 8,650 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? Sounds like a shitty deal. Okay, like... Okay, I'm out of ideas on how to deal with this guy. Like... Say no to all the extras check. Yeah, I did that. I don't need this boat anyway. Now wait a second. Don't go away mad. I'm sure we can work something out. Sorry, Stan. I'm out of here. Sure, sure. Think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. Is he going to teleport again? Did I already give you my card? Here. I'd better give you another one just in case. Thanks. All right, let's try this again. Howdy. I just knew you'd be back. I knew you wouldn't be able to get that little beauty out of your mind. Come on, let's go take another look at her. 
Wild gesticulation! I smack my headset. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? Pretty soon you're gonna have to make me a serious offer, you know. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 7,750 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? Let's talk extras. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the taco meter? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? Oh yeah. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you? I'm gonna do it one more time. I'm gonna do it one more time on the repeat, just to see if I get any extra out of it. Piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd still like to pay 2000 That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? How does 3,000 pieces of eight sound? That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious... Dealing with now. fucking used car salesmen. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I had patience once. Does 3,000 sound any better now? That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Okay, okay. 4,000 pieces of eight. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight. New dialogue. Okay, okay. Yes! It's Fuck crazy. you! Okay. And I thought I was gonna give my children Christmas presents this year. Just take it out of here. I'm glad to get rid of it. 
Oh yeah, do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. I'll bring the ship and the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. Oh my god! I really felt some bonding here. And I don't just say that to everybody. It's been great doing business with you. Really? Sucker. See you at the dock and don't forget your crew. All three of them. Three. Three. There's one more. Oh no. May not look like much, but it's mine. Who else can I recruit? Maybe I need to go loot the governor's mansion now. Just go to the dock? Okay. Oh, because I count, don't I? I probably count. Hey, it's a good thing you showed up. Ten people have offered to buy this baby off me while I've been standing here waiting for you. But I said, no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? Of course I am. Oh, my dude, if you could fucking social distance a little bit here. Aerodynamic. A buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. Please take your hand off my ass. I think we're having a real moment. No, we're not. We're not having a moment until you take your hand. I can't give her up. You can have your money back. How could I sell something so dear? Then again, a deal's a deal, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I'm out of here. Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands! Maybe I should have gotten that extended warranty after all. Hey! Long time no see! Have you come to be on my crew? Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Um, uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? Glad you could make it, Carla. Look, don't start with me, okay? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? How are we gonna get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? Where's the cabin boy? Well, I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. What's going on here? Where's our ship? Where's our crew? This isn't going to be as easy as I thought. 